Dmitry Mendeleev, a Russian chemist, laid the groundwork for what is the modern periodic table of elements. Mendeleev recognized patterns in the atomic weights and properties of halogens and alkali metals. He observed similarities between different series of elements. To make sense of these patterns, he created a card for each of the 63 known elements at that time. Each card contained the element symbol, atomic weight, and its chemical and physical properties. Mendeleev began to arrange the cards in order of ascending atomic weight, or mass, grouping elements of similar properties together in a manner that led to the early organization of the periodic table. Mendeleev's new arrangement of elements showed a more complicated network of vertical, horizontal, and diagonal relationships. In 1913, English chemist Henry Moseley developed the application of X-ray spectra to study atomic structure. Moseley learned that the frequencies of certain characteristic X-rays emitted from chemical elements are proportional to the square of a number which was close to the element's atomic number. Moseley arranged the elements in order of increasing frequency and assigned each one a number, called the atomic number. Atomic number is determined by the number of protons in the nucleus, which subsequently has the same number of electrons in orbit about that nucleus. When the elements were arranged by increasing atomic number, the periodic pattern was observed without having to switch some elements as Mendeleev did, and holes in the periodic table led to the discovery of new elements. When elements are arranged in order of increasing atomic number, there is a pattern in their chemical and physical properties and is referred to as the periodic law. That law led to the modern periodic table. The last major changes to the periodic table resulted from Glenn Seaborg's work in the 1940s, starting with his discovery of plutonium and the transuranic elements, which is any element above atomic number 92, or uranium. These elements are radioactive and are made in nuclear reactors and particle accelerators. Seaborg reconfigured the periodic table by placing the actinide series below the lanthanide series. In 1951, Seaborg was awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry. Element 106 has been named Seaborgium, SG, in his honor. There have been some recent additions to the periodic table. As of 2012, there are 118 confirmed chemical elements. 114 of these are recognized by the International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry, which is a worldwide organization composed of national chemical societies from 44 countries and is recognized as the world authority in devising chemical terminology, standardized methods for measurement, atomic weights, and many other critically evaluated data. No element heavier than Einsteinium, element 99, has ever been observed in macroscopic quantities in its pure form, and no elements past 118 have been synthesized as of 2012.